Hello! Welcome to Magic Arena. I've not played Magic in a long time and I felt like playing it. And it's Monday. <laughs> Beginning of the work week, a little tired, so I figured I might as well relax. Play a card game. Might as well. Um, for those of you who don't know, uh, Magic the Gathering is a trading card game. Uh, they release Magic Arena. Pretty much you play the game online. Um, I like it. I haven't just not played in a while. I prefer to have the physical cards, but um, I also just really enjoy playing. So we're going to hop back in. Um, as always, everything is archived on YouTube. There's merch if you want to deal with that. We run ads because we donate charity. We're still giving everything to PCF. Um, I... Is it? Two days. Give or take. Tomorrow, probably tonight I'll just get it, get all of our numbers together and donate over there. Um, and then, as always, if you'd like to see more magic, I don't know if we even played any on the channel yet. We might have. I don't know. It doesn't matter. We're going to get into it. Let's see. I'm having a little issue with OBS, so let's see if we can get it. So it's very odd that the audio cuts out like that. But I don't know. We're playing magic. We're going to get into it. Um... So there's two drafts here. I'm going to do the quick draft because I'm not sure. The only difference, I believe, is reward. So we're going to use our gold. Um, if we get all seven wins, we get uh, 950 gems and two packs. I don't know why I'm looking at it through the capture. I should look at it on the screen that it's on. Premier draft, though, is double the price. We can win up to six packs. Um, because I have not played in a while, we're going to do a quick draft. Uh, what this is, um, you play until you lose three matches. So uh, each one's progressive. So the first win is going to be uh, one pack and 50 gems, then one pack and 100, and so on all the way down. Um, we're just going to give it a good go. Uh, in a draft, you open a pack and you pick a card. This is what we have here. Um, what is this? Okay. Uh, um. If it's a zombie card reveal, put it in your hand. If you don't, you might put it in the graveyard. Give me that. Alright. Vampire. Uh, create a blood token. A blood token. Sacrifice a side effect. Draw a card. That's pretty good. When you sacrifice a blood token, you gain one life. That's not bad. Cleave. You may cast this for its cleave cost. Um, that's okay. Um. Life link, though. Nah. Oh, eh. What? I don't want to go straight black, though. I want to get a little bit of variety, but... Ooh, we might take that, though. Oh, look at the cap. Uh, normally, I play green-black, so... Apparently, I'm just going to go for blood now. Exile target zombie. No. Disturb. You may cast this card from your graveyard. Ooh. I like that. And this dice created two do zombie. Oh, give me that. Alright. We need some high cost. Somewhere. This enter is tapped. It's a 113. That is a great defender. Sacrifice a blood token. I like this though. I want the that's some heavy defense. Granted they can fly over it, but that's fine. Maybe I will go mono black. It's not what I was thinking about doing, but
Because now we need synergy with the blood token, so it might be blue, or it might be white. Or if we can run out enough zombies, that would be cool as well. Chill of the grave. Ah, give me that one. Give me that zombie. Zombies are our friends. What is this? An assassin. And it's bad if the creature gets minus two, minus two, until end of turn. Pick. Hmm. If they control no other creatures, I don't like that as much. Another heavy defender. Blood. What is it? Uh, draw a card. Do, 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 do. Uh... Yes, more blood. Apparently, we're going to base everything around blood tokens, zombie. Um, oh, I mean, I guess we'll just reveal their hand. You choose not only card from it. May have a two or less, and they discard it. Alright, so that, if we get that in the beginning, that's a good card. Oh, good, and we can double down on it even better. Ooh, I don't like that. Um, we'll take that, because we might get blue. Yeah. I was hoping that was going to come back. I didn't even read what that did. Hey, hey, what's up, man? Welcome on in. Welcome to Magic. Not something I would have thought I would have been streaming, but we're doing it. There's no black side from this, and I really don't want it. It's magical. We're doing a draft, so I get to pick a card from the pack here, and then I pass the pack to the next person, and then the other person hands me a pack, and I take one card from it. That's a good card. We don't have a lot of blue, though. Changui True gets plus two, plus two, as long as it's a vampire. Yeah, we do have a few vampires. Ooh, we can double down. Servitor. Pokemon Yellow stream soon. You want a Pokemon? I would have to find. Uh, I would have to find that. Or did you want me to do a uh, Let's Go Pikachu? Because I can easily find that. It's not the same by any means. Servitor. When it enters, you get the token. But this is counter. I like the counter. Yeah, I know there's a difference though. Um, I do have Brilliant Diamond that I have not gotten back to. Vampire. I'm gonna think about it. We might end up dropping blue, and I. Zombie bear. <laughs> Give me my vampires. But we're gonna have to keep blue, so I'm gonna have to commit to it. You have a copy. Oh yeah. I thought you Yeah. I don't know why I thought you had a different Pokemon game, but yeah, I have Brilliant Diamond on the Switch. Um I think that's the only Pokemon game I hate. Oh, I have Pokemon Moon somewhere on DS. I don't know where that's at. I don't like any of these cards. It's uh, four cards in the grave. I guess we'll just take that so no one else can have it. We'll play it that way. Zombie. Knife. How many knives do I have? One? We'll take that then. Yeah, it looks like I have to play blue with it. May exile two creatures from your grave if I do draw a card. Spectral binding. Ooh. But we could get the Drake and have flying. How's my cost looking? Let's get the Drake. Vampire kiss. We'll get blood tokens. Apparently, we are gonna play blood. Just, I. Uh, so I think we can just pick off. That they can't have. Uh, 
As long as we have some synergy, we'll be good. Cannot be blocked if I pay five. Ooh. Ooh. Five, five for six. Now let's take the low cost. We want to hit him hard and fast. Ooh, blue black. Exploit. Ooh, I like exploit. Oh, no matter what, we get the crab. Apparently nobody wants that, and nobody's playing blue. Alright, next one. Ooh. I like that art. <laughs> I really like that art. Um, let's try to even out this deck a bit. No vampires here. Well, there's a red one, but we can't switch colors now. It's a little too late for that. So we may lose to a red-black. That's a good wall, but... To end of turn, target creature becomes a blue serpent, and it's 5-5. Five, five. I'll take that. We can double down on that. The more doubles we can get, the easier it's going to be to grab things. Destroy target creature or planeswalker. Give me that. Some good removal. I'll take that. What are you? <laughs> Catapult fodder. The beginning of your combat on your turn. If you control three or more creatures, they each have toughness greater than power. Yeah, we don't want that. We're not playing transform. We'll take it. It's solid. We can double down on that. Hope that Drake can... Oh, another siphon, huh? Okay, we got a lot of blue to look at. Thirst for discovery. Draw three cards. Discard two cards unless you discard a basic land. It's an interesting card. I'm going to think about that. Can only be blocked by creatures of flying. We might take that. It's good to have unblockable out there. Zombies cost one less. How many zombies do I have? One. Two. Three. I don't think I have enough zombies. Four. Ah, five. Wait, I took that? Oh. Oh well. We're not going to use that. Nah, I want... Actually, what are you? Awakening. Turn target creature. Graveyard of the battlefield. They may pay a swamp. When you do, return it. Oof, you're expensive, though. How many of these do I have? Two? I will take that. We'll even it out with a little bit of blue. Whenever you cast a nine creature spell, create a one one white spirit. Uh, maybe. I like those eyes on that. Whenever you cast a nine creature spell, the top card of your library, you may put it into the grave. Nah. I'm not playing Grave Run as much as I like Grave Run. So we'll just take Chill the Grave. Counter spell. Okay. Fear of death, that looks sweet. Mill two cards. Chain creature gets minus X minus O, where X is the number of cards in your graveyard. 
We're running a lot of tokens. That's a good card, though. So how many knives do I have? Two. How many guys do I have? One. I could have sworn we picked up another one. Make sure we have two. Get a second wall. Actually, exploit. Nah. Get a second wall. Yeah, nearing the end, it's really easy for me to grab stuff. Because at this point, we're just looking at colors. Um, nobody took that, really? We'll take it, we won't use it. And last card, we don't get a choice in the matter. Alright, so I have to take um, two cards out. No, I have to take 19 out. Well, that's fine. Yeah. Alright. So now we need to drop extras. We took this. We don't need it. We want that. We want that. As long as we have synergy, we'll be good. Lantern of the Lost. I think I just took it because I had to. Exile all cards. Yeah, we'll drop that. Drop that. Zombie, we're gonna keep it. It's a zombie. When the size you may search your library for a card. Nah, we only have one. We don't need it. Zombie. Drop that. Start near the bottom as well. I like that we have two of these. This is extreme removal. I love it. Uh... Whenever permanent with ward becomes target of a spell or an ability and opponent controls, counter it unless they pay the ward cost, which is two. We're going to keep it in because they won't think I have it. Good wall. Here's some flying, we're gonna keep that. Menace is great. Drop that. I like that we have that. Drop that. Cause this is, so normally when you do a draft you should be putting things in your sideboard to get it out of the way, but I sorta of just wanted it to keep going. can drop that. I didn't really want... I mean, I, I, it's useful. I need some more flying, so that's fine. I like that I have this. That's our counter spell. And then we get blood tokens, so we can draw, so we can get more cards. As long as we're not going against Mill, we'll be good. Dies to make a token. Alright. Uh, discard a creature card, draw a card. Um... I mean, I guess we could drop the knife. But, I want to be able to make more tokens. Gift of Fangs. Chain Creature gets plus two, plus two, as long as it's a vampire. We'll drop that. Alright, eight more to drop. So what I really want to focus on on the ones we only have one of. The odds of us getting it are much lower than these ones we have too. Also, now I just thought about that. If you hand me your copy of Let's Go Pikachu, I'll be on your save file, right? Maybe. I don't remember. I'm stuck back in the Game Boy days. <laughs> oh, zombie cleric.
I'm spending way too much time trying to make this work. In this one, another zombie dies. Look at the top card of your library. If it is a zombie card, you may reveal it and put it in your hand. If you don't put the card in your hand, if you don't put the card in your hand, you put it in your graveyard. So I can just reveal the top card. I don't want it. Oh, this can only block creatures with flying. Ah, I read that wrong. Well, good thing we have to cut stuff. Vampire kiss. We'll drop it. We only have one. All right. So th this is really nice. We can see the whole deck on the side. <sighs> times three is great. Times two is solid. The monastery that I want to keep it. I like it because I won't see it coming. <sighs> it's expensive, but it's such good removal. Sparky, go away. Well, if I rock with 44 and we go against a mill deck, I'm going to let it roll because we could, that could save us because uh, there was mill that I just sort of let go by and if we run out of cards, we lose. So having four extra on a deck that we have doubles in. I think that's gonna work. All right, two swamp, can I play anything in the beginning? I can play this. All right, good enough for me. All right, say hi. I can sort of see my hand. I was w worried about the overlay being in the way. That works, we can play the ceremonial knife. Oh, you took the invitation. <laughs> I like I like their character over there. While they're tapped out, I'll get some more creatures out. Play the ceremonial knife on either one, because they're the same to me. And then we'll carry on from there. Also, there, there should be um, an overlay. You can see the deck, I hope. <laughs> it was a new extension I turned on. Hopefully it works. I don't know if it does. Oh. As long as it's your turn. Well, 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 I don't like that. Ooh, we can put the knife on the zombie. Cause they know I'm gonna block. <laughs> Interesting, I like that. Okay. I like green. Green is probably my favorite color for this. And we are just not doing good. I did not want them to do that. I mean, we get the we get our first blood token. I sort of wanted them to block. Oops. 
Excuse me. One one. Uh, let's do this. There we go. That's what I needed a while ago. Try that. Two twos. You know what? Yeah. Then we get another blood token. Attacks, target creature and opponent controls gets minus two, minus O. Oh. Alright. And then we're gonna pass. Go and use our siphon. <sighs> Can't be blocked by creature to a power to a less. So I can block with the geist. Now, I'm confused why they didn't do that on their turn. One short for that. Interesting. Okay. We'll take it. Yeah, 
Yeah, so the blood tokens do have a price to them. They got me. All right, that's fine. Them finish it out. Uh, okay. So we played around with the blood tokens a little bit. Can't really do much about that. too heavy with the blood tokens. <laughs> That's fine. So let's see. Because all of these are singles, which is fine, I guess. Actually, you know what? We're gonna keep what we have. Um, we just couldn't get any land. And that's what it is. Um, sometimes that happens. I wanted to see if this extension is working. Make sure it's all good while we load in. Two swamp. We oh, I can play this first turn. Han. All right. Let's hope we get some better draws. Uh, early game is what really hurt us. I'm not sure how we could change it other than just I don't want to flood it with more land because that's not going to be ideal. Those are my colors. Man of value two or less. Oh, no cards to choose. That's what I thought was going to happen.
Okay. Like, the idea behind this deck should work. And if it doesn't, I'm... Just what it is. We're getting back into the swing of it. I'm getting enchantment. Two seven. That's awesome. I need a swamp, come on. I mean, I need an island. <laughs> um, get rid of that. Actually, no. There we go. We need one more island to play. Uh, now you tempt me. I'm just gonna. Cause I know you're gonna let me just swing. They, they may have got me. Not what I needed, but we'll take it. Uh, I'm gonna get hit pretty hard, but we can use the siphon and uh, counter something. Let's mitigate some of the damage. Really good card. I like that card. All right. <laughs> we'll just do that. All right. And 
I can't even play it. Well. Cannon life. Plus five, right? Yeah. So seven, twelve, even if I gain that life, it's not gonna help me too much. Is that, yeah, I'll be too short to survive a good hit. Yep, we have to defend, and I don't think there's going to be anything left in the deck. <sighs> Good play. I like that deck they're using. Minus 13. Oh, that was petty. Nice. Okay, so we need to switch a few things out. So let's see here. If I do this. We drop all the blue. Hey, hey, what's up, Logan? Stack your deck, I mean. Maybe. <laughs> Welcome in, we're doing a draft. Um, I haven't played Magic in a while, and it does show. So even if I just go straight black, it's not enough cards. Yeah. So we'll go back, we'll drop all of the ones. Hmm. My, my, my. I think they may have gotten us on this one. It'll be fine, though. We can do another another draft after. Whenever creature control exploits... I don't really have a lot of exploit, though. And I have enough blood counters. We'll get flying back. Get the monastery, which I don't like that are double blue, but... I don't really have a option. We'll keep our removal. Put the top four cards for your library. Put those cards in your hand and the rest under the grave. <sighs> in the bottom in any order. Nah. I guess if we drop the monastery and we add land back in so land because that makes life easy 43 monastery was our heavy hitter though so I sort of need to take that we don't get a chance to play it, though. And nothing else is much stronger. I guess we'll leave in the deck the way it is. All right, we got one more try before we get kicked out of the draft, and then we're going to come back in. But this was a good way for me to see what was new in Magic. And then we're going to play our original green-black style, because that's what I like. Hey, look, it worked that way. Alright, let's look at what we got. Okay, so I'm happy with that. We got a turn two play and we have options. Keep seven. Oh, so there we go. Shout out Logan over there. If you don't see him, he streams in the morning. I'm, I used to be around in the morning. Now work is what it is. Like, over there, it's always a good time. 
Always a good time. The uh, what did I play? Swamp. It'll be 10 in the morning Eastern, and I believe that's 3 for everyone in the UK. 3 in the afternoon. I'm probably wrong on that. I'm horrible with time zones. Just got a creature draw a card. Uh, you're my fodder. You're gonna make me a zombie. I'm gonna try to make this work. Oh, you're running mill. Oh, come on. Come on. It is a... <laughs> Not as bad. Let's enter his create a blood token. Sacrifice a game of life. Alright. We got solid defender. Uh, no attack. Alright, we got the monastery. Zombies control of flying. You're the one who took all my zombie cards. Oh, man. Alright, fair play. <laughs> I can't be mad about that. Alright, we'll hold off. That way we can actually use a siphon. We're gonna do this. We're gonna drop this. When it casts with cleave. Now we can just discard something from their hand. Oh, they got one of these two. Yeah, these they took stuff I had. Um plus two plus oh, an additional plus oh plus two and has death touch. Yeah, get rid of that. <laughs> get rid of that. It's a one four. Alright. We'll swing, because we need him to kill this so we can get a zombie. Get a zombie, we can get on the road to something. I may have built this death room. <laughs> there you go, thank you. Alright. We got four, I need six for the monastery. Um, even if we just get one land, we can use our siphon just carrying on to counter things. The zombie's going to keep pecking us for one. That's fine. We can take that. <sighs> why? I'm getting confused why you're milling yourself, though. That'll be fine. We'll do it this way. Make a blood token. Keep that on the side. That way if we need to, we can burn some of our own cards. So one four. Go attack with a zombie. And if you double block, which would be Weird, we'll just take out the butler. We can do things that way. Or you're just gonna eat it, one or the other. Either way, getting a step towards the goal. Perfect. Nope, that's exactly what I need. We get a little crowd control, build everything up. I like that. Nice revival. Nice. I like that. Then you... Okay, I see what you're doing. So pretty much, he, they have a setup where they're just going to keep cycling zombies in. I like that. That's a very smart way to do this. Which I'm actually pretty impressed you got from a draft. Means I drifted. <laughs> You're flying, yeah. 
which that's what I was worried about was flyers. Uh, but now you only have one defender. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> Exploit. Yep, and now your creature goes off. That is smart. I like that. Smart zombie. Um, here it goes. That'd be fine. So I need one more for this. So let's risk. Let's risk it. We'll drop a siphon for this. There we go. Um, no attackers. Alright, so we got the land we need, so on our next one we can play the monastery. But, overall, if they drop another big creature like that, that won't be good. Because that, this is going to hurt. Yeah. He's a siphon. We get a blood token now, and we're gonna counter the creature. Nice. We're not out of it yet. We're getting beat down pretty good, but we're not out yet. <laughs> you played another zombie. Fair play. Alright, swamp. Monastery. Eat the hit. You can eat the hit. There's no point in attacking. Hmm. I like that. Visionary Stitcher. We're gonna need to look for that. Good game. Good game. Right on the money, too, with that damage. Alright, down we go. But we're not out yet. Now we have an idea of what... Well, wow. I haven't played in... Three sets now, so... I like that, so no matter what, we got a pack from it. Granted, it could have been cheaper, but it's fine. We'll hop on in here. All right, so doing it again. We're going on in. We gotta be smart. I like this card. It just kept coming back, but we'd have to make sure mana was always on the side. Gains each end of turn. Ooh. Gain trample plus X. So X is a number of. Alright, so this would be... That would be very risky for me to try to get. Because we would need to get extra ones. Infested werewolf. Whoa. So you create insects. You're expensive. I'm going to think about that. Vile spawn spider. Six, six for six. Okay. As Bayfield, you gain life equal to the greatest toughness among other creatures you control. So if I'm playing and this is out, I would gain three. Um, that's into the graveyard. That is tempting. We could try Grave Run. 
Tread carefully. It's not the best pack to start either because we don't have a very clear direction for this. Imprisonment. So this is a pacifism. And you get a blood token. So that's not bad. That's not horrible. I'm tempted to get this mulch though. I really am. I guess I could have kept this and then used it on their creatures to make them weaker to kill them. Ah, it's fine. Retrospect. Hindsight. We'll take a mulch. We're gonna go green on this one. Top seven cards of your library. Put two land cards among them on the battlefield. Tap the rest on the bottom in any order. It's a, that's a good card. Um, but I don't know if they have landfall anymore. They may have gotten rid of that. Gonna be upkeep. Sacrifice creature. Hmm. Undying malice. Dies returns to the battlefield tapped with a counter on it. Evolving Wilds, I mean, that's a good card. Draw a card and they get, I want that. I want that. I want some stuff in the air though. We could do green and what, green and red? Deal five damage to target creature or planeswalker. If that permanent is a spirit, steals two damage to their controller. I mean, that's very specific. Sanguine. Oh, I remember that. I used to play Sanguine Blood. Uh, wow, that took me back. <laughs> I'm glad I'm playing Magic again. This is nice. Um, So we got green. We could double down on Mulch. I like having at least two of each card. Uh, okay, we'll take a wolf. Nice, there we go. Okay, okay, we're getting it together now, Scorpion. Death Touch. That's what I'm talking about. And again. No, no. We'll take that before somebody else does. Millipede. Mill three cards. For each cre- Oh, yeah. That's a good Grave Run card. Another human enters the battlefield. It gets plus one, plus one till end of turn. We already have two. I really don't want to grab three of them. We don't have to use all three. Okay, and then our pet came back around, I think. Uh, yeah, I guess we're gonna be playing this. Evolving Wilds, I mean, that gives us a free shuffle if, um, we're hurting on land, but right now it looks like we're running straight green. This cannot take a loan. Untap target creature. Let's take the Evolving Wilds, um... It's always good to have. Which is web. Alright, so now you're gonna make me take red. Alright, we're going in with red. Defender and Daybound. 2 6, that's good. Yeah, I'm taking that. Ooh. Too bad. Too bad. Into the night. Becomes night, transform all day bound permanent, so our prisoner would transform. Okay, so right now we're just gonna drop that down, because we don't need it. Alright, so red and green, red and green. Oh, and then we got some nice vampires now. I sort of wanted to take them so nobody else has them, but that's gonna hurt our deck. So we should just focus on what we have. 
Snarling Wolf, do we have that? No. The low cost is a smart choice because we can buff it. We could buff it on turn two and have it hit. So we're going to take that. I do want the Lightning Wolf. Which we can get. Deal two damage to each non-vampire creature. That would hurt us very bad. Uh, I want that, again, because that's a, it's a good defender. Apparently we're gonna get three of them, so. Snarling Wolf. I feel like I should have taken that Snarling Wolf, though. But that's okay. I gain control of target creature until end of turn. Okay. Ooh, here we go. Destroy target creature with flying or destroy target enchantment. That's, uh... Three. So this is their, the new Act of Treason. Okay. Um, I, I like Act of Treason, so I'm I'll like that. Uh, we'll turn up the one target card. Uh, tempting. Ooh, we can get four. We can just finish it off. Ah. You know what? I'm gonna take that, though. Yeah, I don't think nobody really wants this thing. So we're gonna keep ours at three. When it dies, deal. Th I love that art. That looks amazing. It's a six four for six, and when it dies, I can deal three damage to any target. So that includes my opponent. It's an expensive card, though. Well, we'll take the green. I mean, we're evening this out. I like that. Ooh, all green. That's what I'm talking about. Laid to rest. Whenever a human dies, draw a card. Whenever a creature you control plus one, one counter dies, I gain two life. I don't think we have that many humans, though. One. Two. So all together we have five, so that's not fully worth it. Choose up to one. Destroy target artifact. Fight target zombie. That's very specific. Uh, what hand is it? Attach it. Okay. Let's take the wolf, though. Um... Let's take that. We don't need it, but we'll just take it from everyone else. Uh, we'll take this. Gives us more options. We might not use it, though. Yeah, and that's what I figured was going to happen. That's four. Which I'm honestly surprised we got four, if anything. So we did stack it a little bit in our favor. <laughs> Pack Sung Pup. That's cool art. I like that wolf in the back. All the eyes back there looks great. I'm gonna do combat on my turn. If I control another wolf, which I will, 
more than likely. I can put a counter on it. So I just keep it alive. I can really just buff it. Yeah, counters are permanent, so we'll take that. That's a good card. It's a good card. Um, not a lot of things here. We can... Wedding invitation. I could get a second one, I guess. So I'll make it a 3 2 with trample. Reach. Cast of Spells Ode had Flash, so Flash is a mechanic where I can just play it like an instant. Um, I can pay two more for it. Nightbound, it's a 6-3. That's great. Um, we have four of these, there's no point in taking them. So I have, I have one. I mean, that makes a solid defender. I can say that. Um. Pay three for a three three on my turn, or I can pay five on their turn. Nightbound is six three, so I mean, they would defend and try to kill it. Yeah, I'll take it. I'm I'm really on the fence about taking it, but we'll take it. Add one mana of any color. It's werewolf. I can add two. I mean, that's solid. That's good. When it enters, I create a boar. I mean, that's good. I like that. But we're playing with wolves, so we'll get the spore back. You can mill two. Create an insect token. We're not really playing tokens. Wolf it is. Actually, how many of these do I have? It costs three. We have three already. Alright, so... I mean, this would guarantee it, but... Did I take any of these yet? It costs two. No, so I'll be my first one. Yeah. Four of them. Okay. That's fine with me. Another betrayal. Perfect. Get another wolf. Okay. Okay. There we go. It's evening out. Nobody took a fear of death? Really? Oh, we're done. <laughs> Alright. 8-8 eight, eight and Evolving Wilds. I'm happy with that. So, let's... Let's even things out. What do we only have one of, and is it worth it? Massive Might, we'll drop that. 
I was hoping to get more of these. This is a solid card. Scorpion. Let's start our heavy hitters. We'll keep all of those, actually. Drop that. I want all four of those. Uh, End of the night. I guess we need those for our uh, werewolves here. that. I'll drop that. We got 50. That's too many cards. Too many cards. I like the scorpion, but we're gonna have to drop it. Mulch. Go down to two. I like that. I want to keep the Evolving Wilds because that gives us a free shuffle. I don't want to run 48 cards, though. So. Part of me feels like the Pup is going to be our ace in the hole. I can feel it that way. It just feels like this card, we can just let it sit there and it'll get stronger. Because I think we're running all wolves now. If not, I'm going to cut something out. Uh, reach. I got to keep that, though. Werewolf. Werewolf. No, insect horror. Elemental. So there's three cards that we're not really running. If I drop mulch in the millipede... That would get rid of our grave run. And then if I do land. It still has me at 8 and 8. Really? Okay. That's fine. You know what? I'm going to run 44. I'm going to run 44. I feel like this is going to be solid. Um, I'm always worried about the mill decks. Mill decks always come in pretty hard and fast. We got some reach, not a lot of reach. We have no flyers. We have no counters. But we have a lot of aggro. We have a ton of aggro. So we can go in and we can be just aggressive. That's what I'm hoping. Oh, we got that Evolving Wilds. Even better. Yeah, we'll keep that. We'll keep it. Play sharpshooter, and then right after that, give it the buff. Oh, they did the same thing I did, green red. Ooh, I'm curious what direction they went. It wouldn't make sense for them to go for vampire. There we go. Guide Defender. I'm happy about that. Ooh. So you need stuff in your grave, huh?
Oh, I see. That works for me. And then you can hit me for one. That's a that's a good exchange for me. We got two of our we got both our betrayals in our hand. I like that. So we can just take what we need. We I am noticing my overlay is a little bit in the way for the cards in my hand, but that's fine. How oh you took that. <laughs> Uh, I needed one more land so I could play two wolves, but that's fine. You turn into what, a 6 4? Transform. Plus two, one. Yeah. Alright, good. We can block it. And we'll get a buff, I believe, from training. I might be wrong on that. Whenever it attacks. Oh no, we won't get a buff. But we can take the hit. <laughs> An eight, six. Okay. Hmm? Why would you attack? Alright, what are you gonna play? Nice. I can admit when it's nice. Alright. We got four mana, and I don't like that. Not what I thought you were gonna do. I wanted to get rid of the, the prisoner, but all right. Let's see what we got. Draw a card. Got it. Got it.
Interesting. Okay, so we got what? Five? So we can do this. Uh, we'll do this. No matter what, we're gonna get hit with, hit with that trample. Alright, we got plus one out of that exchange. And that's what I did not want to happen. to attack with it. Oh, I can't block it. Good game. Ah. We got close. Not close but the deck works and that's the main thing it's doing far better than the blood tokens for me at least oh yeah we we got in a, a thing done <laughs> one of the dailies done I didn't even look at our dailies I just I fought with OBS pretty hard and I didn't even get this fully set up right because for some odd reason the audio will just leave when I go check on OBS, which is odd. Alright. Two mountains. Two mountains. Let's go. We'll be aggressive. Um, yeah. Yeah. Hey. Hey. <laughs> no, I'll take the win. I, I won't complain. I'd rather actually get an, a real victory, but if they want to scoop. It is their decision to scoop. I was curious about what green-white they were going to run. Because there was a lot of good plays we could have. Alright, so now our win is a bonus pack. Which is cool. Because then afterwards, I, I think I'll just crack all the packs. Because this uh, draft is actually working out the way I thought. Which is perfect. Plus, 
me, this is the best way for me to figure out all the new mechanics. If we win, we do. Um, Evolving Wilds, turn one. We'll do it that way. They just want to go nice and quick. All right. <laughs> well. Everybody chooses a non-line perm they control turn all non-line perm is not chosen way into their hands. Okay. I had to <laughs> I had to read that just to really make sure I knew what it I didn't mess that up. And you know what's gonna be even more fun for me? Because we'll do it that way. <laughs> if you just want a boxing match, we'll do it that way. Nice, got a, got that out there. Sweet. Um, Ward makes it plus two. Okay, so we'll do. Um, Next turn, Sharpshooter. I should have played the Sharpshooter, but I want to make sure we can keep our pup out there. If you attack with the Monastery, that opens up a hole for me just to go right in and get a good hit in. Ooh, nice. So two plus three is five. So I could take control, that's ten. You'd probably defend. You have all your mana still. So let's do... Let's do nothing. Interesting play, okay. They're making me think. I like that. <laughs> so I like the the thing over here. Do you do things? Hey. Nah, you don't. Let me do it. There you go. 
get a nice hit in. We're gonna get hit for 12 at least. But that was worth it to me. So 11. We can get hit for 11. Unless they play something with haste. They can't defend everything, and we have to hit them for one. We should be able to win this. And they scooped. Alright, there you go. Good game. <laughs> we ranked up. We're bronze tier 3, yeah. You can really tell I have not played this in a long time. <laughs> bronze tier. I, maybe I'll do this every Monday, who knows? Who knows? Hey, we did another daily. I gotta cast... Uh, six more red spells. Red or blue, but it's gonna be red. Alright. We're just gonna keep going until, um, well, we win all seven. <laughs> that, that's the goal. But what I've learned in Magic, there is no perfect deck. God, we have no mountains, but I really love that we have three. This is a gamble for me to do it this way. And it paid off. Forest, forest. All right, next play is the prisoner. Yeah. So the wolf is gonna defend against the Bloodseeker, and we're going to take three, then we're going to gain two. Next move, play the Prisoner, unless we get a good draw. Oh, my God. Good play. I don't want to play into the night because we can't actually play both of them. Nice. And then you gain five life. That is very smart. Very good. I can't stop flying. <laughs> That's about it. I just can't stop it. Yeah, nice.
even if we exchange, it'll be fine. Nah, we'll leave you as a defender. We'll do that. We have a lot of ground to make up. And three turns to do it in. So. It almost doesn't matter because we can't defend in the air. <laughs> That's the problem. I mean, that is the downside of this deck. It, I don't have flying and only one creature with reach. So as soon as something's flying that hits hard, that, that was, uh, that was going to be the end. But still, we, we're still going good. We're at two wins, so we get uh, 200 gems in a pack no matter what. Like, no matter what, we get a prize just for winning which is good try to remember card shop used to do that as long as you won you do a, a draft and you would win off of a, you get packs based off how many wins you had we'll keep it a little heavy on the mana but we'll keep it so if you won all four you got like 10 packs or something 12 packs or something like that. Which I thought was cool. That was very nice of them to do that. And it did get a lot of people to play. But. We'll just do that. And then next turn we'll play this. That ain't cool. color interesting I mean I guess that does give you the most variety oh you're flying I don't like that <laughs> but we got a good defender out which I'm happy about
I'll take that draw. I'm not against it. I am not against that draw. So I have to cast no spells for it to become night. Can I block? If I cast no spells, it would become night. And that's what I want. Now we're gonna go and be highly aggressive because we're gonna play, play our enchantment and then that should be enough damage to kill him, I believe. Well, no, we'll be one short, one short from the wing, but that's fine. Oh. Well, maybe not that. Oh no, I can still do it. Perfect. <laughs> Fair play, good on you. I'll take it. Then stay again. So if they had any nighttime cards, it, it's taken care of. Okay. And then hit me for three, right? cards in your hand, what are you going to do? Because I think I just out aggro them at this point. Um, they, they did good. you can counter it. That's good game. Yeah, you're tapped out. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, nice win. We'll take it. Climb that rank. <laughs> Alright, the wolves are doing great, so when we go into the normal game... Hey, look at that. I got a mastery orb. I did something. I did something good. So if I get, if I decide to stream this more, um, we'll have to keep wolves in mind because they they are doing great. Their downfall is flyers, though.
So I guess we'll do like uh Ooh, I like that. I like that skin on the card pack there. Two and two. I guess we could do like wolves and archers or something. Um I'll keep it. Yeah, I'm gambling on getting one land, and that's fine. Yeah. Uh-oh, did they DC? Uh-oh. There we go. You gonna play spirit? That's been the theme so far. Oh, that yeah, we could do that. We could do wolves and spirits. Yeah. Double strike. Hoping we could get a, a land. Right. They might get us. We're not gonna give up though. You never know what we can draw. That looks amazing. I love that art. Um. Of course, we get a wolf now. Aye, aye. Well, we can get rid of the twin blade. Yeah, you're gonna get me in the sky. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're gonna beat us, I know that. Space out out. Uh, I can take out the token. I can take out the lantern bearer. That's not what I needed to see. <laughs> They're good. Nice. Nice. I, I, I. Nice. They're doing good. They're showing me a lot of uh, versatility. Cause I normally don't play blue white, so this is nice to see how it works. Oh man. What does this do? Does it keep spawning them? Nice. 
I can't defend it all, so I'm just gonna get toss up the GGs. Such a nice, it's a fluid system too. I get, it's just fluid. I like that a lot. I think that was our last loss. Eh, let's see. Not bad, though. So the thing I was worried about was the thing that actually took us out. <laughs> so, I think we did good with that draft. Much better than the first one. Alright, cool. Let's open these packs up. Let's see what we got. And one man of any color. Okay. Vampire kiss. <laughs> Spiked ripsaw. Oh ho! Creatures with plus one one counters on them have base power and toughness four four. Holy crap. I know we don't have enough to make an uh, angel deck, but that is, that is awesome. Uh, what is this, wild card? Yeah. Vampire, so we're getting some, this is a good spirit, okay. Hexproof, I love that. Beginning of combat of my turn, put two plus one counters on another target creature you control for daybound. Nightbound, other permanents you control have hexproof. Okay. Beginning of combat, put counters on. Wow. I like that. I like that a lot. And our last pet. Werewolf, okay. Ooh. Vampire cleric. Voice of the Blessed. If you gain life, put a counter on it. If it has four or more counters on it, it can now fly, hits vigilance. If it has ten or more, it is indestructible. So I'd have to gain life in ten separate uh, things. And a mastery, I don't remember what, what's up at. I don't remember what we were doing. I got one. What is it? Just cosmetics, right? That's all this is? Yeah, that's what they look like. Card styles. I mean, it doesn't really matter to me. I play green a lot, so... We have to start at the bottom. Alright. Alright, that's just a skin. Nothing we can really do about that. Yeah, I don't think I have enough gold left. We have three. It was five to do another one, right? Yeah. Uh, we're running out of time. Yeah, we're just about up for the first time in a while. We're actually going to stick to our two-hour uh, thing. What is mad science? What is this? Oh, we have enough for this. Uh, machine time to capture energy. Da -da 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 -da. Zombies. Love me some zombies. What card style? Are these just... Oh, these are just skins. Yeah, what... We don't need cosmetics. We need cards. We need actual cards. Um, that being said... I don't even know if I have, uh... Any decks that actually count anymore. Invalid decks. Oh, all oh, my invalid decks. Oh, let's do um this one. 
Uh, this is one of the decks they give you for just participating. So if you download the game, the game's free. If you download it and you get through the tutorial section, you get decks in the game. Which are cool. And then I get every season, or block, you get another standardized deck set. Which is cool, it teaches you the mechanics. Um, that being said, I don't remember what's in this deck. So we are gonna wing it, and we're gonna wing it hard. But I play green black normally, so. We have no one drops, right? All right. Play a swamp. Okay, I know what we can do. I got a little confused. I thought I was probably gonna do the uh, the four toll cost card. Best way to handle that, but we took care of some board presence, evening things out, and I believe, yeah, that that can work better. I don't want to waste our poison in the cup. I want to keep it. Oh, well now. Yeah. 
Wait, why didn't it go back to my hand? Is it after that's done? There we go. We'll do it that way. Knock my counters down though. I was one short. My math was off. <laughs> Poison the cup again, huh? gonna be removing back and forth that's gonna be what we do and I don't this could have grave run in it and if it does even oh you can't ex you can't exploit yourself okay plate to have a defender. That should be a six, right? Uh, give me a one. Okay, no, so it was just how many we played that turn. Alright, that's fine. That's how this game's gonna go. Nice. It's a copy. Oh! That's what happens if you copy a legendary. I don't know why you would want to copy a land. Oh! Yeah, and then it dies. in the lead. Then we play the ooze because oozes are cool. You can't even see it. We got an ooze. Slime tunnel. What? Hmm. Interesting. Did you do it?
Yeah, I did that right. Because then we can use big play and defend with the ooze and kill the sludge monster. Or you can defend. I mean, hey, whatever you want to do. No cards in your hand, man. Gotta let it happen. Walk right into it. Sacrifice. Yeah, I mean, if that's how you wanted to do it, that's fine. Stitcher. Interesting. Okay. You gotta swing with that 5-5. Five five. You're flying too. You're gonna hit me for five no matter what. Those are gonna be defending. So I need to keep one back as a defender. And you have to block it or you lose. You sacrifice it. And then I block. 3-3. Three, three. Oh, it's flying. Alright, good game. So I forgot it was going to be flying. Well, that was a very good game. I am happy about that. Especially using a deck I have not used in a very long time. So that makes me happy. There we go. Alright, I think that's going to do it for me, though. Let's flip this camera. Let's get that camera. See, this is what I mean. OBS is weird. Because now the audio is gone. And i got to click back into the game. It's weird. I don't know. But... If you would like to see more magic, I 
I like magic. I don't mind streaming it. So, who knows? Maybe we'll get back into magic here on the channel. I might play it every Monday just to play it every Monday. Just to have a consistent uh, way to keep up with magic. Because there was a lot of things I didn't know. Like uh, the blood counters didn't... Those are all new to me. But hey, I had fun with it. And that is the main part of playing magic is having fun with it. So, with all of that out of the way though, always remember to take care of yourselves. I'm going to catch you on the next one. See ya.